Friends, welcome to Gate 2023 Topper's Talk. We have with us Gate Production and Industrial Topper, All India Rank 1, Mr. Gautam Godimela. And Gautam is Rank 1. It means Topper of the Year. He comes from Hyderabad. He did BTEC long back in 2006. He has also done MTech from ISC Bangalore. And he uh, earlier was enrolled in Made Easy Postal course last year in 2022. He has he was also enrolled in test series over the years multiple times. His father is manager in SBI, and uh, he is now retired. And the good thing about the Gotham is that Gate 2020 rank six, Gate 2021 rank two. Gate 2022 rank 35 and Gate 2023 rank 1. So Gautam, you are best example that consistent performance and year by year you have improved. Yes. Except in 2022, it slipped down. Yeah. And production and industrial is the branch in which the support system is very less. Yes. Either yes. students they go for mechanical, otherwise yeah. coaching support is very less. Yes, sir. And you prepared, I, I believe that it is your hard work you prepared. So how you prepared and how the PIE students should start preparation? So actually my main motivation to write GATE is to refresh my basics as I'm already working. So with respect to production and industrial engineering, I being mechanical engineer. So I thought when I want to refresh the basics, like mechanical, I studied long back. So some in-depth subjects, if I start preparing, it will take time, I understood. But whatever fluid mechanics, solid mechanics, thermodynamics, heat transfer, these basics are there, that is there in production industry engineering also. So I thought okay. I will write PA. Up to last year, I have written in PA. I think last year onwards, they have given option for writing two branches, like mechanical and production. So this year, I written uh, mechanical and production. Mechanical, I got 500 rank. And okay. uh, production, I got first rank. So it is not about like, I feel like rank is one number. So it is a relative also. You can see my performance is also like that. But my main motivation is to get in touch with the subject. So many people ask me why you write GATE. So simple reason is like I work for a government research organization where uh, I need to be in good touch with my subject. Otherwise, doing the job will become a little difficult because long run, everybody will forget the basics. Same happens with me also. Like around 2010, I joined my present job where I do some design analysis research related where I need to be very good in basic mechanics, fluid mechanics, thermodynamics, everything, heat transfer, even production, manufacturing. Like when I design a product, I have to design it for manufacturing. If the manufacturability is not possible, designing is very bad, actually. So what yeah. I understood from my job also, like first reason is like day in, day out, I will see many problems in my job, which are interdisciplinary, which needs a very good fundamental understanding. So I found I have to be in touch with the subject. And you appeared in PI as well as in ME. What difference you feel? And in PI, if someone wants to score top rank, in which area he or she should focus? Obviously, production industrial engineering, more focus should be on manufacturing, sir. Then next one is like uh, industrial engineering, OR, basically. IE is simpler, but comparatively, OR, uh, where more topics will come. Even some extra topics of engineering services, basically, like... TQM and robotics, some extra topics other than mechanical, they are there. So I found like people who are preparing for engineering services could write production. That will help them a lot for their mock test preparation. I myself, because I feel that production, they should concentrate more. Because mechanical, whatever you do finally, if you design the product, finally it has to be produced. It has to be manufactured. So I found like PA is a good thing where I can start refreshing my basics. So long back around 2020, I started writing. Uh, then I mainly write, I already told you, that is the reason. Second reason is like in my office also, like every four years, there will be assessment promotion interviews. So to that IIT professors, IIC professors will come. They will see our work and judge whether we can be promoted or not. There, this IIT professors, IIC professors concentrate on exact basics, which actually are related to gate exam. So whether it is a production or mechanical or aerospace or XC paper, mainly the questions will be right. They, their mindset is in such a way that they will dwell upon the basics which we'll forget doing a lot of research work, project work, whatever we do. So I found to be in touch with the subject, it will help for my assessment also. 
So last year I cleared my assessment interview. Actually, even though last year I didn't got good rank, but I was able to clear the assessment interview. So that actually is a motivation for me. So first reason is to be in touch with the subject to work for daily job basis. And second thing is like for the uh, assessment interviews. Third thing is mainly PhD. So in near future, I'm looking for PhD. So PhD written test will be there, which is similar to GATE. So it will be helpful for me if I show this in interview. Right, definitely uh, in the GATE will help you in uh, PhD enrollment. Do you have a plan of writing GATE again next year? I will write, sir, because mechanical, I got 500 rank. Uh, so that's what I want to tell you. Like, I want to refresh my basics. I want to be in touch with the subject. But how can I know that I am in touch with the subject? There should be some benchmark checkpoint. Yes, so assessment has to be done. Uh, checkpoint. Because ESC, I cannot write. Long back, I think 2007, I have written. Uh, so because of age bar, you can't write. Age bar, I cannot write. I can see the papers, but seeing the paper and on our own writing, rather than simulated actual uh, environment is different. So, GATE is a good benchmark where I can compare myself with the current generation. Uh, hmm. That's what I felt. So, I will write, sir. I will write. Like last three years, I have written next also, I will write. How was your performance in the test series? Was it similar to the actual exam? Yes, sir. Almost similar. Actually, test series developed a lot of confidence in me, actually. So, I think last time in 2020, you conducted that computer based mock test, two mock tests towards the end. Right. In both, right. I got first rank, actually. Hmm. Anyway, that year I got sixth rank. That may be different, but actually your uh, mock test series are more like uh, exactly concentrates on PE syllabus because Medis is very well known for engineering services and gate. So engineering services syllabus is similar to production industry. So I feel right. like the test series of Medis is more similar to production uh, of the PA because other things. Because of to... COVID, last two sessions we could not conduct the CBT, but yes. uh, from next year now we are planning again to conduct CBT yeah. mock test. I will definitely write that. Sir. Right. So thank you, Gautam, for sharing your experience and definitely students will love to learn from your experience. And yes. this is amazing that after completing your master's also and almost 14 years of and even more, you have completed your BTEC, but still you are uh, uh, having passion of learning and you not only learning, but you are proving yourself by securing the rank. Many congratulations thank you, and thank, thank you very much for sharing your experience. Thank you very much. Thank you.